Welcome to Zern. In this video, we'll show you how to assign students to a lesson on Zern. Zern Digital Lessons work alongside your live instruction, complementing what your students are learning. Zern aligns with your instruction at the unit level, or as we call them in Zern, missions. So if you're using Zern as your core curriculum, your live instruction is already aligned to the sequence of the Zern missions. If you're using another high quality curriculum for your live instruction, you'll assign students to the grade level mission in Zern that best aligns with your current unit. Zern is designed for students to work through the mission at their own pace, moving on to the next lesson as soon as they successfully complete the prior lesson. That means you don't need to align Zern lessons and your live instruction on a daily basis. Sometimes students will explore a concept on Zern first and then come ready to engage during live instruction. Other times, it will work the other way around. What's important is that the big idea of the Zern mission is always aligned to the unit you're working on during live instruction. Now, let's assign your students to a lesson on Zern. Once you have confirmed that your roster is correct on the Roster tab, go to the Assignments tab at the top of the page. Start by checking the box to select All Students and then click Change Current Lesson. Choose your grade level and then find the mission that best matches your current unit. For example, if your third grade class is starting a unit on fractions, you'd select Grade 3 in the drop-down menu, then select the aligned mission, in this case, Mission 5, Fractions as Numbers. Once you've selected the mission that best aligns to your current unit, set the students to the first topic and lesson of that mission. That means that you would select Topic A, Lesson 1. Once you've selected the lesson, click Assign, and that's it! After confirming, you'll see that all students have been assigned to the new lesson. In our case, Grade 3, Mission 5, Lesson 1. Let's see what this will look like for students. When students log in, the first component of this lesson will be at the top of their feed. After they complete all parts of the lesson, students will automatically advance to the first component of the next lesson. Whenever you begin a new unit, you always want to assign students to Topic A, Lesson 1 of the corresponding mission in Zern. You don't need to place individual students on different lessons. Starting students on the first lesson of the mission will give your students the best on-ramp into the mission content. Then, during each lesson, Zern will diagnose any unfinished learning and provide whatever adaptive support a student needs right into their daily lesson at the exact moment they need it. Just remember when you start your next unit in class to simply repeat the process, assigning students to Topic A, Lesson 1 of the new mission on Zern. And that's all you need to know to assign students to a lesson on Zern. To learn more, join our hashtag MathFam by connecting with Zern on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook for ongoing ideas and inspiration from fellow teachers.